Hi everyone. Hope you all are doing well. Hi everyone. Today we are going to work in my journaling book. We are going to see if we can use some of this stuff that I picked up at the Dollar Tree. I had to get some glue sticks because I was out. We also got these napkins at Dollar Tree. And I have these three red, red, uh, blue and white and blue paper. We're going to try to put something together with that. We got these blue, red, white, and blue stickers. Um, I also found these in the dumpster, these stickers a while back. We're going to see if we can um, use them as well. There's some um, red, white, and blue here. Um, there's another blue one here. So we're going to see if we can put something together in the journal book. So let's get started. First, we're going to find a page here. Um, let's see. I think we'll just start right here. My page won't stay down, so hopefully we'll just work on this side. Um, let me see if I can set something there. Okay, we're going to take this blue. I think I want to put something right here, so I'm going to tear that. So we got this piece here. We're going to glue it right there. And let me open my glue sticks. Okay, I put some glue on this. We're going to stick this right here. And I didn't come all the way to the edge. Hmm, that's not good. There, we'll try that. All right, now I think, let me set this over here. Maybe this will hold it down. I'm just dropping everything. Okay, now I have this red piece of paper. I think I'm going to maybe make it slanted. Let's see. We can tear this. This paper is a little bit thicker. Okay, we're going to see if we can maybe put it like right in there. I'm going to tear this bottom part off a little bit. And I'm going to put glue on the back. Okay, I got the glue on the back there. We're going to stick this down now. And hopefully it'll stick right there. All right. Let's try some this blue and white striped. I think I want to make a little square right here. So I'm going to use my scissors. Hopefully that won't come off of there. I think I'll just cut a square here. I think like that. And guys, we're just winging it. So um, just going to see what this looks like. I'm going to put that right there. So I'm going to put some glue on it. Okay, I got the glue on the back. Let's just stick it down. All right. There. All right. Got a little wrinkle in it, but it'll be okay. We'll just smooth it out. And looking pretty good here. Okay, I think, sorry about that, my cat just jumped up on the table. I'm sorry, that was Gigi. So, let's see what else we can do. Okay, I'm going to use some more of this blue. I'm going to put it right in there, and I'm going to make another kind of a square, I think. Uh, no, I think I'm going to do a cross here. Let's see. 
do a cut there, just like that. Let me set that there. And I'm going to cut the end off like that. And I think I'm going to put it right here, like, like this. So let me put some glue on it. Okay, I got glue on the back. And we're just going to put it right here. So what I'm going to do now, not to bore you guys, I'm going to finish covering this all up and I'll let you look and see what it looks like when I'm finished and then we'll go to the next step. Guys, this is what I got right here. I covered it all. Now I think we're going to use uh, part of this napkin. I think I'm going to cut this part out and I'm going to put it right here. So let's do that now. Let me open this up. You can watch me. I think. I think I'm going to just put that right there. Then we're going to see. Um, if we can open this up and see what's in there. So I'm going to take this, open it up. I'm going to cut along this and then we'll, I'll take the ply, the two pieces of it together. We'll take it off. Okay, cut that. There we go. Whoops, I dropped my scissors. It's been one of those days. Okay, let's get this like that. We're going to put that right there. So, let me, let me glue that and I'll be right back. Okay, I got it. I'm going to put it right here in this corner. And I like that it has the wrinkles in it. It makes it like it's blowing maybe in the wind. I got that right there. I like that. Okay, and you can see the red coming through. All right, let's open these up and see what we got here. We'll just cut the end here, and we'll look at them. Okay, the first one we have here, if I can open it. Oh, all right. Here we go. We got this. And I don't think I'm going to use this one quite yet. So I'm just kind of seeing. I might use cut the uh, light up the sky on 4th of July. That's pretty, but we're not going to use that one. Let's open up another one here. Okay, look here. It's these little... Um, gnomes and i love gnomes we might put a little gnome on here might cut it out um i like this one i'm gonna cut this one out right there i'm gonna unassemble this let's pull this apart i think i don't think it's too hard hopefully i didn't rip him Okay, now I'll take the back part off. Okay, there we go. Set that aside. Okay, this is the one I want to use. So I'm going to cut him out. Let's see if we can stretch it out a little bit. I might use that star, I'm not sure yet. Okay, and all right, let 
let's see. I'm going to kind of press him out a little bit. And we're going to cut him down just a little bit on the sides here. Cut this bottom part a little bit. And I want to cut, fussy cut around this little star. And right there, his little hat. And go down a little bit. Oops, almost cut his arm off. Okay. Don't want that part in there. So, all right, there we go. We have him. I don't know what that's on there. So we're gonna glue him on here. So let me glue it, and I'll get right back with you. And you can put glue on him. Let's put him on the side here. There he is. I like gnomes. I think they're so cute. And I will trim the top of that off and just tuck it under for now. We got that. Okay, let's look at the other fan and see what it looks like. That was the first one. Okay, let's see. This was the second one, the third one. Let's see what it looks like. Oh, that's neat. I like this star right here. I think we will put the star right here. So let me cut that out and we'll put it on there. Okay, I'm going to put the star down now. I cut it a little bit, but I didn't want it too, too big. So we're going to put that right there. What do you guys think so far? Leave me a comment down in the description. Okay, now I think we're going to use these stickers here. Let's open them up. We're going to use these stickers. I thought they were very cute. I think, let's see, we're going to make them go down and we're going to put USA right there. So we're going to start with this U, and we're going to start right there, it's a U, and S, U, S, whoop, stuck to my finger, U, S, A, and I like that, U, S, A, okay. And let's see, so we use the stickers, we use the napkin, and we use the fan, and I already had this other color here, so let's see, we had some other stickers right here, I think I'm going to use also, I'm going to use one of these, and I think I am going to put that in this corner right here, like that. I might put one down here. Right here. Whoop. Right there. Okay. And let's see. I might have something else to put on. Okay, guys, I had some of these. I think I'm going to add these to these flag. I'm going to put them right there. If I can get them on there, good. Whoops, that one didn't want to stick very good. Okay. So we'll just put all these on here and I'll get back with you.
Okay, I think I'm just gonna do these four right here. So I have a little bling right there in the corner. And then I have a big heart here. I think I'm going to, I think I'm gonna stick it right here. That's his big heart right there. So I apologize for having such a long video. This is the completed 4th of July, and I do wish everyone a 4th of July. Um, please be safe. Um, tell me if you guys like this, um, if you think it turned out nice. Um, tell me what you're doing on the 4th of July. And as always, guys, please hit that notification bell so you're notified every time I upload a video or go live. Um, also, uh, hit that thumbs up for me, guys. Leave me a comment, and I answer everyone's comments. So, as always, guys, I love each and every one of you, and thanks for watching.